stages of this pre-season friendly as both clubs get ready for the new season which is looming ever closer just a few weeks away now and Girona might have an early goal here rebound from Valadigos into the wall of green shirts that had lined up to stop it Liz Smith slightly over here but did get through to Ake at the back post. This time had nothing for Carlos to worry about though. And the corner by a Fogori. Solanke holds it up. And Solanke does well. He's Smith. Can he pick up Wilson? Instead he looks at the top of the D. It's Gosling. Wilson helps it on. Neat stuff from Bournemouth. Watts at the end of it. Well, it's the first significant shot on target for either side. But it's also straight at Juan Carlos. Long ball four by Akala. Bit too long though. Oh my goodness gracious me. Well, Mark Travers' heart must have skipped a few beats there. Crikey. Andy Ofabori, part of the Nigeria squad at the Under-20 World Cup, a product of the Bournemouth Academy. And also play at centre-back. Wilson slides it through. Solanke is onside. Solanke! Stopped by Carlos. This Liverpool man might feel he should have done better. And a foul by Smith relieves the pressure. in a dangerous area, Boselli. Born for waiting for a whistle that never came. It's still Boselli. And stopped by Travers. And it is Dobre yet again. For Kenny. Good tenacious work. Doesn't fancy the shot though. Off a of Bori. Plenty of power, not quite enough precision. Here's Wilson, terrible mistake from Girona, and a good recovery block. A very good recovery block from Pedro Acala. Both sides with one big defensive lapse in this first half that they've got away with. Travers and Ake up the other end earlier on. And this time it was Alcala and Matteo. Callum Wilson is not a striker you want to set through. Gosling fancies the shot. Two runners up back in 2010, League One runners up back in 2013, Championship winners in 2015, and then so successful in the Premier League since. But they could be 1 0 down here. Good save from Boric. Denies Sonny. Here's Mark Guell. Forces a save from Artur Boric. Pack. Slides it through. Mark Guell thought he got there. He was tripped. I think it might only be a yellow. It is a pre season friendly after all. The severe low knee striker causing a few problems. And I think there's another yellow card coming out here for. And we look at, we've got a second card. Oh my goodness me, it's upgraded to a red. He's off. Bournemouth are down to 10 men. There was widespread confusion about what was going on. And for the last quarter of this game, the Cherries will be down to 10. It was initially given as a yellow. And yellow has become red. 
Jack Simpson has to walk. And this will be a pre-season test of Bournemouth's ability to cope whilst being a man down. And here comes Jordan Ibe. Wins a corner. And that is really Bournemouth's first significant foray forward in this second half. The overlapping run instead uses I and the Liverpool man Sermon. Neat flick in behind and Surridge needed the block and it got the block. The defending on both teams in key situations has been quite impressive today. And Zuana could be a four on four. Zano has options, one of them is Guau. Boric had to make sure. <laughs> Terrible mishap at the back, and Girona have the lead. Based on their second half performance, it is nothing more than they deserve, and it is nothing more than that man Mark Wilde deserves. It was his run that caused the sending off. Come Bournemouth looking for a near immediate response. It's Ryan Fraser. Ryan Fraser scores. Like London buses, you wait for one, then two come at once. Straight up the other end. Ryan Fraser, who has barely been in the game in this second half, slides in left footed, and it's one apiece. in six minutes and it is the Spanish supporters celebrating once again Anzuana Denied by Boric, who came out well, closed the angle. 